let's make some gift tags for some Christmas presents. We have a template set up so we can easily change out names to run multiple batches if we need to. All we need to do is type in a new name and print the file. So here we'll switch from Paul to Henry, then print the entire set to the epilogue engraver. In the dashboard, we'll see our processes. One is an engraving process, and one is a cutting process. For the engraving portion, we'll load in the 500 dpi clip art text engraving settings for wood from the materials library. And we'll select Stuckey as our dithering pattern with bottom up engraving. For the cutting portion of this job, we'll import the 8th inch wood cutting settings. Then we're actually going to adjust the speed up to 25% as we determined that worked well during testing. Then we'll send it to the laser. At the machine, we'll load in our sheet of wood. This time we're using a sheet of pre-finished alder, which is actually the same wood we use here at Epilogue for our classic and very detailed Aztec calendar sample, which we send out to people who are interested via our website. With the wood loaded in, we'll start up the job. The laser will start with the engraving, then we'll move on to the cutting. Once finished, we'll extract the tags from the work area. We'll give them a light scrub to eliminate any residue from the wood's varnish. Then we're good to go and the tags are ready for prime time. A little bit of unique holiday cheer for Beneath the Tree this winter, made possible by the power of an epilogue laser machine. <laughs>